Uh, we just arrived here at Kamaini Jesus, and it's pretty sweet over here. Just uh, looking for the actual structure. There's a lot of like Jurassic Park looking trees. Hey guys, Nicholas Colas came in here. Uh, we're doing a little update. We're now in Lukban, Philippines. Lukban, Quezon. Philippines. Philippines. <laughs> We're in the Garden of Eden in the Kamaini Jesus. Kamaini Jesus. It's pretty sweet over here. But then uh, we're just walking around. We happen to see uh, Noah's Ark behind us. Here, wait, let me walk up a little further. Get a little closer. There's a lot of little animals and stuff in the background. Look at there's Moses. The Filipinos are very religious. They built a lot of stuff. Oh, again, the sun's blocking it. Can we walk? Can we go in there? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh, shit! It says speak. Softly, guys, I gotta speak softly now. I can't, I can't videotape in here. It's a house of prayer. Be right back, guys. There's Moses. What's up, Joe? <laughs> That's what we hear. That's what I hear a lot. Uh, I, I heard it more last year. Yeah, it turns out uh, we, we didn't go in Noah's Ark because it's a place of worship and we hear people praying. And um, it said exclusive or inquiries only. So we're just like, oh, we probably shouldn't go in there. There's the uh, Ten Commandments. Yeah, we Thy will be memorized. done. Yeah, yeah. I wish we had to memorize again. I'm. St uh, we. Can, I think we got it memorized. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and um. Museo, Museo de las Manos de Jesús. Oh, you see how good my reading is. It's closed though. But yeah. Oh yeah. And I want to thank one of my YouTubers. Uh, my new YouTubers. Um. Tinkerbell1791. Uh, I love having new fans and new and new people to comment on my YouTube videos. But thank you a lot. We'll be doing a Balut challenge in a couple days. Tomorrow. Yeah, just to go to Bukas. Just over here checking out uh, Naked Adam and Eve. pretty sweet and that's probably the angel condemning them out of the Garden of Eden that's why they're outside the, the gate thank god we're still inside the gate so all right so if you guys can see that all the way up there that's I think it's like the third biggest statue of Jesus in the world or the it's in like the top 10 or something but yeah that's like pretty far up and we're about to start this journey upwards 200 steps to Christ, I believe. More or less. Okay. Alright, so we just started walking. Oh, I'm talking about Kuala. Bira na lang. Kale wa sa kanto. It is a corner. What I like about it over here is it's pretty cold. It's not like Pagbilao or Lucena where we stay. Oh, and there's uh, goldfish. Koi fish. I think those are. Not goldfish. Oh, koi fish? Okay, whatever. Koi fish. Yeah, I know what a koi fish is. Hello. I know what a, ko what a koi fish is. Hello. <laughs> That's what I look like when I'm not YouTubing. 
Yeah, this place is pretty sweet. Come on, Jesus. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Are you walking up there, hey, Joe? <sighs> One step at a time. I didn't know these stairs would be too big. <laughs> you guys made it. Joe. Okay. Yeah. These people are taking pictures. Wow. I'm just over here. Bow wow, Mackin guy. I'm not Bow wow, wow Mackin guy. What is that? It means you're not allowed to talk like loud and loud. Shut up. Isn't that what it means? It is. I checked my dictionary. Okay. So we walked up a little bit and we decided to take a little break. Oh, you Jesus. decided. We collectively decided to take a little break. Are you tired? There's a lot of steps, but uh, she wanted some water, so I guess we had to stop. I didn't take <laughs> the water. But then we saw this view. Oh. Up. Wait, can you zoom? Oh. Ah. Bad at this, guys. It's a pretty sweet view. We're pretty high up. I gotta remember I'm not allowed to talk loud. It's a holy place. So I gotta talk quietly. I don't want to be that one guy. So the next time we come here, they ban foreigners. <laughs> Just like what the Japanese did for marriage. We gotta be humble in our walking, so it's not so loud. Do another update in a couple more steps. Guess where we are, guys? We are almost up this mountain to see Jesus. Ugh. It's a lot harder than I initially thought, huh? but God is with us, and at least it's a mountain, so it's a little cold. Oh, look it. This is the final stretch. I think I'm just going to record as we make our final stretch. Hazel's kind of been uh, keeping me behind. She's been slowing me down a little bit. I had to take a couple breaks. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I've been pretty lazy in this journey. Hazel's actually been striving ahead of me, that's why I didn't do too much more videotaping. Oh, look at The steps are getting easier. <clears throat> but maybe we're just getting stronger. <sighs> we're just about there. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy guacamole. Alrighty, this is what we came here for. To so Luke Vaughn, Kaiser, and Philippines. Philippines. It's a nice gentle wind up here. As Nicholas Kowalski came with another update here. Keep on forgetting to speak softly, whatever. Nobody else, <clears throat> nobody's really listening to that. So, yeah, I found some quiet little space. Here's a drinking some water. Let's just talk to you guys. Now, this is a cool place here in the Philippines. <laughs> it's, um, it's kind of far out here, the, the drive over here. It's kind of dangerous. I almost crashed a couple times in the jeepney. Because the people who drive here are completely crazy. I don't know, but damn, this looks like the jungle. Wait. This looks like the jungle, like for real. Like, dude, I want to go over there, like to that mountain. <coughs> Tomorrow. What? 
No, I'm just kidding. <coughs> yep. I don't know what that shit is. <sighs> so yeah, I think we're just gonna chill up here for a little bit before we go back down. You know? No. Yeah. Let's go down now. I want to drink some water and sit down or something. No, <laughs> Let me. Look, I mean, like, look at where we have to go down to. Right, right here. Just stare at the f floor a little bit, and then boom. Got to go all the way down there. My shot on now. What's up, guys? This is Nicholas Colas coming. Excuse my cough. Yeah, we made it to the top. So you guys, I'll see you now. We're trying to make it back down without falling. Ugh. These steps are really steep. But yeah, it's, it was worth it. It'll be more worth it when we're in the jeepney going back home and feel the. My hang in the wind blowing in my face, but you know, I could probably say this is eating up about 500 calories. Probably makes up for the for the for the food that was prepared for us for our wedding food tasting thing. But yeah, um, we're just gonna try to make a straight drive down. Without any stops. Whew. If only you guys could experience this with us. I wonder if people ever fall. Do you ever wonder that in like time places like this, Hazel? Hmm? You ever wonder if anybody's fallen like down these stairs? I don't know. I don't think about that. But like YouTubers, like your viewers, whatever. When you guys are at uh, Six Flags Great America or like Disney World and you're about to get on this cool, amazing roller coaster, you ever think like what would happen if the ride just <clears throat> stopped in the middle? <laughs> I think about that before I even thought of ever going on going to roller coaster. Like I remember being a kid. And like every other week or so, or at least the once a month, I would see some shit on the news like, oh, one killed in Six Flags Great America, uh, roller coaster stopped upside down, the giant drop stopped at the top and didn't drop or something. So then that's why I don't go, yeah, I don't go on roller coasters, guys. It's because I don't believe in that part. It's not good for me. It's good for you guys. The more people, more people who are like me, means less lines for people like you. Scared, Yeah, I'm scared. I don't want to die like that. I'm gonna die naturally, not on a roller coaster, and not from falling down the stairs. <laughs> but yeah, oh my God, we're almost there. <sighs> no, I'm not tired. Yes, you are. See, that's what I noticed on the way coming up. The steps are harder getting up there, but then once you reach the top, the steps are easy. And now we're getting to the hard steps for our final couple ones. Oh, I think there's only like eight steps to go. Whew. Yes! Dude, guys, I feel like Rocky. Rocky Marciano in the first movie. When he just like ran up the steps of the Philadelphia Museum of Art. Yeah. Oh, you're oh. I'm gonna take a nap right here. <laughs> but anyways, uh yeah. This was a highlight of our day and it was completely like we weren't even gonna do this, Hazel. What? We weren't even gonna do this, so then uh -huh. I talked her into it and she agreed. And you wanted me to talk. To walk to plant first. Yeah, yeah, first we were gonna walk here. And then we I'm glad we didn't. But then it started raining. Like only here in the Philippines will it rain hard and it'll be like completely sunny outside. But we're right next to a mountain. But either way, I'll give you guys another little update later on tonight. Gonna have a couple uh, uploads today, so.
Peace out, hungry Samolipa.